Hello, my friends, and welcome back to Don't Be Afraid. Say, I can already see that you are a very gifted young man. I think you will face no problem solving the battles I have prepared for you here. If you do well, I will be playing with my spear. <laughs> I don't know if I want to play with any kind of spear of yours. Anyway. I'm Jimmy John, and the last time we left off, we escaped his dungeon, and now we're in his house. I don't know why I just don't break the windows or something, but whatever. So yeah, that's where we are. <laughs> Jay. Dear Mr. Deegan, we invite you again to a meeting in the teacher's room. We need you at the meeting to decide on a certain matter. Sincerely, the teaching staff. Interesting. But, um... Yeah, I don't, I don't really know what else to say from here. Uh, I feel like I wanted to say some, some other stuff, but I can't I can't remember anything that I wanted to say. This guy really likes golden fish. That seems like a certain thing. Are you pointing to something? Oh. Ha! Oh, you. Bastard. I, I didn't think that was going to do work. Reach me. There we go. Another one. The Eskimos... Oh, is that how you say Eskimo? That spell. The Eskimos have a special harpoon for killing seals. The shaft is about a meter long and is made of horn and iron. It ends with a blade stuck in the shaft. Sometimes it is the only... It is only of iron or copper. Only its end is not sharpened to make the hole in the seal skin as small as possible. Below the blade, there are two wings bent inwards, which do not allow the animal to slip off the harpoon. Ah, interesting. Kind of kind of like that? Maybe? I don't know. It kind of looks like it. Okay. It'd be uh, real useful to get another candle around here. I don't remember that being there. Uh, I like the nautical theme of this place. This is a dope house. Oh, yeah, that's like bulletproof windows. I couldn't break that. Franklin, honey, I ordered you this spear, which you have been looking for so long. Hmm. I have found it in Victor's antique shop. I hope, it, I hope you will be pleased. I know how much they fascinate you. Love, Mom. What a nice mother. I'm wondering if she actually knows what the, uh, you know, terribleness, the dementia, no, not dementia, whatever, the terribleness that is her son. Dear, I'm worried about our daughter. You keep saying that she's in need of an operation. Everything's fine with her. Please, spare her at least. If you do this, I'll forget about what I found on the third floor. I'm going to work now, and I'll be back later. I love you, Anna. Ooh, no, Franklin went rogue. I mean, not really rogue, but he definitely went insane, or, I don't know, something... This is interesting. Something's happening. We're supposed to find a story here. Was he ever a normal man? Judging by this door, I'm going to assume not. Locked. Hmm. Jay. Lydia, after returning from school, go directly to your room. Dad will come to you. Nope, I guess uh, she's not. He's not sparing her. Whatever it is that uh, is being spared. My name is Franklin. Or application to the newspaper contest. I would very much like to win a spear, which is the prize in your contest. I'm very fascinated by this weapon. I am a biology teacher. I have a lot of artifacts at home and sculptures related to the sea. My dream is to get a spear. Yeah, such a spear. I cannot find it anywhere. It is pointless. No one will ever read it. Ah, uh, poor guy. I'm sure somebody would have read it, Franklin. Somebody. Although, then again, is this Franklin, or did Franklin just kill everybody here? Phone, 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 phone. Somebody's ringing the phone. Boop, boop. Hey, is that you? Honey, where are you? We've been looking for you everywhere. Are you alright? Please. You bastard! 
bastard! That was a great voice impression! I'm not even mad! Like, you... <laughs> I really... I was thinking, like, how the hell does mother know where to call? Does dearest mama? And it wasn't... it wasn't her. It was... it was him. But I still think that was a great vocal impression. I wonder if, like, there's only one voice actor for this entire game. I wouldn't be that surprised. But with that said, like... He obviously just did that voice. I don't know where I was going with that. I, that was... I'm, I'm stupid. Damn it, I really wish I had a candle. I can't see anything here. Can I just walk out the door? Nope, it doesn't even give me the option, even though there's clearly a handle there. Ooh, ooh. Oh, no, that's just... Whoa! Oh, oh! Da! Ha! <sighs> huh. I thought I just found something that wasn't a head. You're nice. Are you my mama? Are you the one who called? It does kind of look like it, but I think my mother had black hair, if I'm remembering correctly. I've been walking around for a while and I have no idea what to do. Oh! What? <sighs> I'm guessing I put a hood on him or something. This. It's a. Uh, <clears throat> I would've been looking around for like friggin' four minutes now. I thought I was looking for a, a spear, but this is an arrow. I thought that was supposed to be like what the spearhead looks like. Oh, I'm so stupid. <sighs> Well, I know where to go, at least. Right over to here. Unlock the door. Okay. Oh, oh. How did you... That... That looks incredibly difficult to get somebody up there. Crucial note that will be useful during my work, inspired by old Celtic and Germanic traditions. Mixing the brain with cement and shaping it into a form akin to a small spirit a small sphere not only provided the user with powers of a dead relative, or in some cases enemy, but also provided an ample supply of supply of sacred ammunition. Ammunition for what? Shooting people. What is Why would you show this can I turn it off? No? Okay. Well a clown's I can't tell if that person's alive. Oh, oh, oh dear, oh. Oh, hello. Oh, you. I'm sorry that you have to watch this for eternity. Are your eyes still following me? Yes, they are. Yeah, that, that sucks, bro. This is... Yeah. Sorry about that. <laughs> I'm gonna go this way now. I don't think you were there before. Oh, your balloon popped. Don't you... Oh, uh, yeah, I don't like the way you're looking at me. With your mouth to your to your hands, like, uh-oh, baby blew a balloon. I'm about to blow a bit. Ooh, mm, mm, nope, nope, not gonna... Not gonna do that. Forget I said anything. <laughs> I don't want to turn around. Don't make me turn around. Oh, that actually, ah, that spooks me good. You're not there anymore, are you? You, yep, okay, that's there still. I'm not sure which is worse, the clown uh, or the kid. Where would he have gone anyway? He couldn't have gone past me. Whatever, I'm going to ignore it. Horror game physics. I'm just going to go there with that. Horror game physics. Oh! There you are! How you doing, bud? You try- Oh, we playing hide and seek? Okay! I'll be waiting. Okay, so I've been looking around for like... Ten minutes now. I couldn't find it, so I had to look it up. And I was looking everywhere for the spear. I level, because, you know, I'm a seven-year-old. And it's right there. I saw it before, too! I just- I thought it was like... Another, another, like, a piece of wood going up, and I was like, oh, well, that's nothing that I need to think of you. 
I'm an idiot. <laughs> also, uh, the the thing looked like we only have about half a game to go. I mean, like we've done half the game already, so that's unfortunate. But um, this is interesting. Oh, I need that, don't I? Yeah, yeah, I do. Okay, so one, two, what? So, yeah, they're the same picture though. One, two. What do you mean one? Oh, hello there. Hello, monkey. Is that? Oh, I thought the monkey had a had a bit of a schlong there. Ooh, picture. Children page. What? This sad mother. Oh, that's sad. Okay, anything else in here before I do what I obviously need to? Okay, monkey, feel free to go off now. I don't know. Were you standing before? Ah, oh, now you're going up. That was an unsettling noise. Did you poop something out for me? Apparently not. Ooh. To buy. Sack, five pieces. Adhesive, tape, 20 pieces. Yep, adhesive tape. Uh, chloroform, five bottles. Rope, 40 meters. Large cardboard boxes, 10 pieces. So, was this like the gradual slip into insanity that he had? I'm gonna guess it is. Anyway, what about you? Have you moved from your place yet? Nope, you're pretty bad at playing hide-and-seek, but uh, you're good at spooking people, you creepy little kid child thing. Okay, so you said one... Two? Okay, well, either way, I know that I gotta place this on you, eventually. Might as well go to you now? One, two. Oh, I... Maybe it's like the second spin of the thing, right? Let me see. One, two. Oh, candle! Got a candle. Didn't even see this before. Okay, so... They are the same, right? One, two. What do you mean? Okay, whatever. Oh! Nope, that's all your torture stuff. What was I looking for again? Whatever, I'm just happy I got a candle, finally. Uh... Oh, what? One? No? So that. Oh, wait, no, it would be one. So this one. And. Two? What? I. Okay, well, I'm gonna guess you still don't have anything for me, so it's probably over here first. Hello. Oh, they weren't the same. Okay, so. I can't believe it. So many people visit me and don't even realize that there is human flesh in the mannequins right next to them. They are incredibly stupid. Doesn't anyone wonder why these mannequins are here? <laughs> Bunch of idiots. Okay, Franklin. I think, well, you're not really an idiot, but you... Okay, really? I mean, yeah, I'd wonder, I'd ask why the mannequins are there too, but I wouldn't be like... Okay. I wouldn't be like, oh, there are definitely human flesh in these mannequins. There's the reason. No, I'd ask you why there are human flesh. Oh, do I have to do it, like, in a row? So, like, this one and then run to the next one? I mean, I doubt you would tell me that they are human flesh. You'd probably be like, I just have a fetish for mannequins. what I do? I mean, I did it. I know that much. Don't you do that. You want you want to play with the ball? Oh, I can't pick it up. Ah. How you doing? Are you are you mad at me? I'll bring you your ball as soon as I can. I wish I could pick it up. Uh, let's see. Man, nope, can't use that. What? Where did the ball go? I'm gonna guess I'm supposed to go. Why are you leaving so soon? I'm not leaving. I mean, you can go, but I already miss you so oh, much. Oh no. <laughs> please, uh, please, uh, come. I, I have seven cute fluffy kittens down here. <laughs> it, it will be so much fun. <laughs> okay, this is either a trap and he's gonna kill me. 
or I do need to go. I'm going to try to play into the whole thing where, like, if you do what your captor says, eventually you can gain their trust, go outside, and then be like, oh, yeah, please, he's right there. Uh, what if what if I don't go that way? I'm going to go the other way. Be right there, you creepy little scumbag. Nope, no, either way. Mm. I don't trust you, but I'm gonna... <laughs> Behind you. I don't see anything. Oh, hello. So that's gonna be how it is, huh? You play yourself up just to kill me. That wasn't a fun game at all. That was a bad game. You didn't have any kittens there at all. I tried to play with you. But you killed me! I should have uh, brought a candle with me. I'm I'm dumb. Oh wait, nope, never mind. Candle. <laughs> I'm smart. Let's see what it says. Additional lesson with a group of students. 5:30 p.m. on the second floor. Remember, talk it. Topic: water environment. Prepare books. Okay, so this is interesting because there's something on the third floor. Now, I don't know what's on the third floor, but I do know it was something so abhorrent that the mother would be... What? You're not... Oh, there you are. That the mother would be willing to forget about it if he saved the child. Or, you know, didn't kill the child. But with that said, what did he do to the child? Did he diddle her? Kill her? Probably. It seems like what this guy seems to do. I mean, judging on that clown video... Stop that whispering. Okay, come on, just leave. Last time, um, I was killed by one of you, so I'm gonna go this way now. Probably nothing in here for me. Mr. Franklin, I have noticed your advertisement in the local paper. I have do but I I do have a special commission for someone with your teaching experience. I'm going to fax you the details. Bad idea. He, your, your students are dead. Uh, what's in here? Locked. Okay, guys. Ready or not, here comes Big Billy. I'm Big Billy. Yep, that's what I thought. Okay. It's either that or you're gonna attack me, so I guess it was the former. Or ladder? I, I don't know. You didn't attack me, so you vanished. That sounded like somebody was walking over to me. Uh... Oh, so this is the girl, huh? I hope you're sexy, because then you won't be as scary, and I won't shit myself. Never mind, too late for that. Oh, hello. How are you? You don't have a face. No, you don't. I'm gonna... Uh... The piece of the puzzle is missed. Well, yeah, but can I not take that? Okay, I guess I can't. <sighs> How are you? You... Don't have a face, right? Oh. Ew. Do I just carry a body of a dead kid around with me then? <laughs> like, that seems to be what you're telling me. Also, what did you do to her? Hey, Lydia, I like you very much. You are nice and good looking. Will you, <laughs> will you go out with, go with me to the cinema? Huh. Well, um, two things. She is not good looking, sir. She is appalling and a grotesque. Oh, the cards were torn out. There is only one left. May 4th. July, yep. May 4th, 2013. My dear diary, my last birthday party was four years ago. I think Dad stopped liking them. June 5th. Dear diary, my mom disappeared. Oh, uh, no. Dad says she left and did not return. He forbids me to go to the second floor. I wonder why. Yeah, so do I. It couldn't be your dead mother rotting up there. Dear diary, mom is still not here. Dad says something is wrong with my face and that he'll have to help me with it. November 6th. 
On that day, Dad wants to do the operation. Your face was better before. Um, he definitely killed the wife because she... Uh, this is this is getting real dark. Uh, wow. Yeah, she definitely wouldn't have left without her kid. So there's that. And I'm just gonna say that, like, she said that she'd forgive him. And that she... Like, she said that she loves him even after all the dark stuff that she saw him do. I wish I had a wife like that. I mean, I also wish my wife would be like, don't... I probably, uh, should... Am I gonna die if I... Is this the splash zone? Yeah, no, that's... Okay, I guess not. But, uh, like, if... Ooh, can I push this? Nope. If my wife was, like, good enough to be like, hey, no matter how screwed up you are, I'm still gonna love you, I'd be happy! I mean, I'd want her to be like, stop being screwed up, of course, but like, I don't know. That seems like true love to me. I mean, you know, to a point. Oh, I bet the bathroom is where I get the piece that's missing to the puzzle. Um, anyway, I don't know. I'd love a wife like that. I'd love anybody like that. Friend, that's what friends are for. But you can't have sex with your friends, so there's a problem there. <laughs> ooh, ooh, what's behind here? A key. Ooh, this one. Yeah. It's Andy. It's Andy. Lydia. The girl that tried to rescue, she is, she's alive, but she's not herself anymore. I've never seen something like this before. This poor girl. I think she doesn't see. When she turned her head in my direction, she didn't react. Listen. I've left the key next to the tape. With the screwdriver, you can open the vent. You can escape through it. The vent is behind the mannequin with a blue hand. Good luck. You know, you know, I did believe this kid, but after seeing what amazing voice manipulation skills that guy had... Oh, it's just an arm, okay. That guy has. I'm now wondering if... Wait a second. Anyway, I, I'll get to that in a minute. But I'm not wondering if he left this all there for me. Second thing is that, if not, is the kid dead? Because that looks like a kid's hand, based upon the sleeve. So, and there's blood over here. Where this is. So, is he dead? Maybe. Probably, in fact. I'm, I'm, I'm willing to say that she's probably dead. He. She. He. Yeah, he. Forgot who I was talking about for a second. Anna. It would be great. I would be grateful if you would like to meet me in private. What would you say? Excuse me. What would you say about dinner in a restaurant? If you agree, please call me. My number is 734-7864. Yours, Anthony. Oh, no. Okay, oh, that was actually, oh, I felt tense in there. That poor girl, yeah, no, she's ugly. I couldn't hear that last part, but I don't want to play with you. But you can only, you can only hear things, so if I don't move... Dummy. Ugh. So if I move slowly, you won't be able to kill me. Hmm. See, that sounds like it would be nice, but I have found more often than not 
that eternal sleep is not a good idea. You'll wake up with bed sores. Bed sores hurt. Was I not supposed to come in here? Come in. You definitely heard that. Okay. Uh, let's see what this says. Tapes? No notes. No. Key to what did I? What? New special item children page. Yeah, that's what I'm at, right? Keychain. Note tapes notes. Well, where's the special? Oh, there we go. Inventory. Tool special. Um, the drawing shows a severed head. How quaint. Ah, uh, you don't see me. You can't hear me. You can't hear anything. Also, she was supposed to not be on the second floor. Oh, wrong way. Where am I going? Wait. No, that... That... Wait a second. No. I gotta go to where she is. Yes, I'm aware. But yeah, okay. Mm -hmm. So there was an area over there, but... Yeah. I'm just going to cut some of this out, because watching me slowly inch forward is probably kind of boring. But I don't want it. No, you're not, because you can't hear me. Look at how stupid you you are. Oh! I'm so glad you can't hear me. That, oh, that was, you're a ter terrifying. Your father's a terrible man. She doesn't even move her mouth when she sings. What a freak! No, but I feel terrible for her. Poor girl. Poor girl. I didn't see you! See, I want to walk, but I'm pretty sure she'll hear me if I walk. So, I'm not gonna. I'm just gonna inch and keep inching. Oh, interesting. They put sound traps. Smart. I'm just gonna walk and pretend like she just can't hear me, because I'm gonna guess that walking is fine. Oh, hello there. Can I go over there without... Yeah, I'm gonna go over here. Key. Okay, so she doesn't seem to be able to hear me walking, so I can just walk instead of inching forward. No, apparently not! What if I just kind of like... Ah! Nope, okay. So apparently I do have to inch forward. Do I have a key to this door now? Hey, I got the key! It's just the... What? What point was this? What was the point of this? No. Hey, look at that. I found the the thing. Can I open that? Nope. Achievement unlocked. A friendly child. Nobody here is friendly. Hmm, hello there. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, very funny. Not funny at all. I'm gonna try to go through, like, at least half this place, because I'm gonna have to edit out, like, at least 20 minutes. So, yeah. Why do you do that? Yes, I'm aware. Locked. It seemed pretty bad at offering it to people, though, so... Oh, oh. No, you don't have a blue hand. I thought you did for a second. Shut up! No, I, I thought I heard the daughter for a second. I'm not sure who to be scared more of, the daughter or you? A freak. Okay. According to the sources learned in Quabala, 
Mysteries. Rabbi from the... Uh, this, uh, okay. 10522 Century, city of Kelm, managed to successfully follow instructions buried beneath the sacred text of Psalms and raise a clay servant known as a golem, the dumb one. While not the brightest of automata, the entity... The entity closely followed orders... Oh, nice, entity. The entity closely followed orders of its creator, as long as they correspond with the word. The word? So, like, the Bible type deal, or or what? I mean, you said Psalms. The only Psalms I know are from the Bible. <gasps> Can I boot this? Oh, can't boot that. Having fun. Uh, nope. Uh, you. Boop. I go over here. Nothing over here. How about you? Ah, journal entry. The students did not stay the night as we agreed. I think parents suspect something. The police are now... The police for now are not snooping around about the boy. Probably will be able to do everything before they start suspecting you. Who... Are you talking to Theodore? <gasps> Hell yeah! Screwdriver. Is this like other multiple endings to this? I'm curious. Oh, now I don't know which way to go. Hello. Um, J. Dear Miss, uh, Mrs. Zim Zipka, your letter has truly moved me. I can assure you that, with my professional experience, I will make your son behave himself. My special cr program, which I'll apply during your private our private lessons, is designed to fix problems with lack of concentration and memory loss. All of that can be achieved by teaching the child how to act. If you want to discuss the details, we can continue the conversation on the number below. Ha, huh, so is that how you got people to... Oh. I see. Oh. Ooh, what's this one? Children page. A drawing shows a few people who are kicking someone. Oh, that's... It's just so weird. Locked. I don't want to do that yet. Oh, is that like a... What? How do... I don't even understand how somebody would sit on that. Or do you just, like, put it on top of their lap? I don't know. Do you put it below or above their lap? Huh. Okay. Hmm. Seems less like... Oh, I forgot about you. Wait a second. There's a candle over here. Too dark scary. Ah! I should be able to grab that. I call baloney. I can't see anything. I have a candle! You know... Uh, I don't know what these hands are, but that jog was in... I, was, I saw it while... Uh, uh, I'm so upset. I saw it. I saw it in the first video that I edited. I don't have it. And I can't go back to get it either. I, I don't even know how I'm supposed to get the other ones, but the point being is that that one... There must be a secret ending, and I missed it. I don't... I don't know how I'd get the arm and the leg, but for the point point being is that I cannot get that ending anyway, so... Forget it, I guess. That's upsetting. Wait, there's the arm, right? Yeah! Cool. Cool, great. I'm... I, I can't... I hate myself. Mm, why? No, I don't want to do this. Check in the box. Achievement. I, I know what's going to happen. Because of the last... What are you? Oh, no. I should have just escaped. Well, up we go. I should have just used the vent. I should have used the vent. Uh... up in the late evening decided to visit his friend, Tom. 
who just wakes up and is like, yeah, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna go visit Tom. Tom Still my jammies. The corner, but David always took a shortcut mm. through the backyard. He always sneaked out through the kitchen window. The kitchen window? Why? Can you just use that? Whatever. Oh. Oh, you mean late in the evening. Okay, so yeah. See, this is why you don't do this, kids. You don't go out late in the evening David somewhere. He didn't want to ask his mother for permission. He knew she wouldn't let him go. With a badonk -a donk like that, who would? I I don't know where I was going with that. I just wanted to say badonk -a donk to be honest. There must be like a stool or something that I grabbed, because I can't just go out the window, can I? No. No, I can't. Okay, so I need something. What am I supposed to do? But the stool he used to get on the worktop was gone. Ah. Mother grew wise to my tricks, huh? Mama? You got a brain in there? I mean, probably. I mean, you know enough to take it away, so... Oh, there we go. Item ladder. Weird. I don't recall seeing that there before, but whatever. Out the window we go. I should have just gone in the stupid vent. <sighs> Why didn't... Mm. I'm going to have to replay this to see the different endings. And bumps and scrapes and all. Sad to see the come alive. Yeah. Bits and pieces left behind. Behind? Behind more what? More and more the darkness comes. You and me will have some. As per J.E., the flesh may hold some metaphysical value in regard to the Eighth Astral House, corresponding to the Greater and Lesser Death and the Constellation Scorpius. However, even in death must one preserve the essence of life, hence the importance of the proper preservation of Archie, in this case, the body. I don't want to have some fun with you, weirdo. Ah, that's... That's a terrible song! Who taught you those lyrics? The devil? But like a really stupid devil? Who can't sing well? Sounds like it. Why are there... Keep going, my friends, towards further parts of the rooms. Wait there, because soon the ballroom will open. Hmm. I see. I really wish I just went into the, uh... Yep. I probably would have died, mind you, but now I'll never know. Maybe I'll just look it up instead of doing it all over again. It seems like a simpler, uh... thing. Especially if it just leads to death, then I would have played through it again for no reason. Oh, it's you! How are, how are you doing? Oh, I bet these are all the producers. Cool. Mm, lies. Took a lot of people to make this game. Wait. Oh, wait, no, it's just repeating it over and over again. Missing part. Ooh, does it say? No. If you know where... Ah, uh, okay. Would have been cool if it was, like, producer, blah, blah, blah. I don't know. Anyway, though. You guys are hugging it out. Garrett Cruz, Cruz, probably Cruz. <laughs> You're spray painted. Locked. Okay. My good, like, how many people have you killed? So many, apparently, which is obvious, I guess. But like, still, there's so many people that you killed. You, sir, are a dick. Locked. Well, what am I? Whoa, that wasn't there before. Was it? No. Eh, no. What? It definitely was. I'm I'm just an idiot. Oh. 
<laughs> we can be friends, right? You're gonna... You're not gonna kill me, and instead you're gonna kill him? That's what I would do if I was in your shoes. Oh, come on. I could totally just sneak right in there. You're definitely gonna kill me. Okay, well... Stop looking at me like that. I didn't know. That's why there are two areas. There's an area there and an area there. Oh, well. Where are you? Well, I found the chair anyway. That's weird. Runny time! Okay, well, I found the chair! <laughs> And boop the chair, up the go, up the ladder. <laughs> David, oh, we're having so much fun. <laughs> You're so obedient and polite. Oh, I think you deserve a treat. But before that, I have one more request for you. <sighs> Would you kindly enter this box? If you do, I might think about letting you go. <laughs> I, I just, I just enter the box and maybe you'll be a home for the supper. <laughs> Leave your backpack on the chair, put out the candle, and enter this box. Hmm. <laughs> that box. Never mind, I thought we were at the end, but it looks like we're not. It's not letting me leave. Well done, baby. I have to get you all ready for the meeting I planned. <laughs> I'm not a crybaby. Selfish man, if I didn't share such a treasure like you. <laughs> I guess I'm screaming. <laughs> Precious. <laughs> Can you make that sound one more time? <laughs> Perfect. Oh, oh, oh. finally. The model with the voice function. Huh. <laughs> oh, music to my ears. Please. Uh, uh. Don't you worry, David. A little while, it will all be over. <laughs> what are you do? Whoa! I guess I'm going Betty. Bye. Whoa! Ah, might as well. It's gonna be about an hour-long video, but to the house to see his friend. This is probably just how I got kidnapped, so might as well go with it. I'll just have to find something else to play tomorrow because, uh, well, he had to take only a few steps through the rock bridge. I guess this is uh, pretty much the simple way. Like, we're, I'm just gonna get this all so done now. He heard a voice. Excuse me. Oh dear, it's Franklin. The stranger turned his head towards David and said, Do you know where house number seven is? David didn't reply and just stared at the man. He couldn't say anything. Oh, don't be afraid. I'm the friend of your parents. Maybe we can go together, said the man. So you just walk away? Can I not go this way? David wanted to run away, mm. but suddenly someone grabbed him. <gasps> mm. What would happen if I followed the guy though? So many questions. Wait, is this not the end? I'm down with the jam, though. Dance in my little box. 
Jeepity-bop-bop-weepo. Oh, okay, here we go. Twist. Twist. I'm actually, I'm down with this beat. ba 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 da ba da ba A pipe. Yes, it is a pipe. I do want a balloon. Hey! Oh, hold on. Okay. This is where I'm stopping. I'm gonna grab that. I'm stopping here. Hope you all enjoyed. Uh, if you did, leave a like. If you want to see more, subscribe. If you want to get notifications for when I post about every three weeks, you can either come to my channel or you can ring the bell. In the meantime, I've been Jimmy John, and I hope to see you all in the next video. Toodaloo!